This short video explains how cylinder gas forces can create resonance and vibration problems on reciprocating compressor packages. We also look at how to avoid these resonance problems by employing a mechanical analysis. A reciprocating compressor generates these dynamic forces. While pulsation forces can be reduced through adequate pulsation control, the remaining loads have to be addressed in the mechanical design of the piping and support system. We recommend viewing Beta's training modules number one and number two for an introduction about these forces, as well as an overview of resonance, natural frequencies, and pulsation control. Now let's look at the gas forces in more detail. This animation illustrates how the forces inside the compressor cylinder act in the direction of piston motion. Now let's apply these forces to a real compressor system. This animation shows a vibration in three throws of a six throw compressor. The animation is an ODS of actual vibration measurements taken on the frame, bottles, and scrubber. Cylinder gas forces will cause each cylinder to move and in turn cause piping and bottles to vibrate. Notice how the scrubber and bottles will move in phase with the cylinder motion. If the natural frequency of the piping system coincides with the frequency of the gas forces, then resonance will occur and amplify the vibration. Any piping connected to the compressor can be affected and experience fatigue failure. Areas of particular risk include nozzles, small bore piping, such as sight glasses and drains, and other small connections. Since it is impossible to reduce these forces, Beta's role is to ensure the mechanical design of the compressor and piping system can accommodate these loads. The cylinder gas force is made up of different harmonics. This means the vibration can occur at different orders of compressor run speed. This chart illustrates the amplitude of the gas forces at different frequencies or orders of run speed. Using our proprietary modeling tools and extensive field database, we develop accurate finite element models to identify where resonance occurs. The ideal solution is to modify the natural frequency of a piping system to avoid resonance. But sometimes it's impossible to do this, especially with variable speed compressors. In these cases, Beta will conduct a forced response analysis to evaluate if the predicted vibration and stress is below acceptable guidelines. An accurate model plays an important role on deciding what modifications to make. If simplistic modeling techniques are used, then expect vibration problems. With almost 50 years of field troubleshooting and modeling experience, Beta has developed the industry's leading approach to solving these mechanical vibration problems. And we work closely with the compressor OEM and packager to implement the most reliable solution. In summary, the mechanical analysis will evaluate all dynamic forces, including these cylinder gas forces, and identify ways to avoid resonance or, if necessary, to manage resonance. Thanks for watching, and we look forward to working with you on your next project.